Duck, the Great Western Engine, is one of the most hardest working engines on the island of Sodor. <laughs> and happily does what he is told. And he even has his own branch line. And he happily pulls coaches and trucks up and down the line all day. And he even helps engines that have broken down or are in trouble. One morning he pulled into the station, then he just stopped. Oh no, said his driver, you have burst a safety valve. Don't worry, said Thomas, I'll take you to the repair yard. Thank you Thomas, that would be great. So Thomas coupled on the duck and then took him to the repair yard. Thank you, Thomas, said Duck. Now, Duck, said the fat controller, you will be repaired by tomorrow night, so I'll have to get another engine to do your work. Please, sir, said Thomas, can I do Duck's work? Now, Thomas, would you be able to do Duck's work as well as your own? Yes, yeah, said Duck, I do a lot of work. You mightn't be able to do my work as well as your own. Ach, that will be no problem, said Thomas. Now, Thomas, if you need to ask for help, feel free. Don't worry, sir, said Thomas. I will be able to cope just fine. So Thomas collected Duck's coaches and took them back to the yards. Then he had to collect his own passengers at the station. Shunt Gordon's coaches then had to take one of Duck's passenger trains. Now Thomas was running late with his own trains and was starting to feel a bit tired. Mustn't be late, mustn't be late, he said to himself. Then he arrived at the junction. You're late, Thomas, said Henry. I know, said Thomas. I have been doing Doc's work as well as my own. You seem to have got yourself in the right predicament. Why don't you ask for help? I have not got myself in any predicament, and I do not need to ask for help, said Thomas. Diesel had overheard the conversation and was starting to make a plan. At last the passengers boarded Henry and with a mighty puff, Henry puffed away. Thomas set off soon after. Then, he arrived at the next station. Where have you been, Thomas? said Verde. I think it's about time we have had another race. You have kept the passengers waiting. Listen, Verde, said Thomas. I am doing two jobs at once, and it is very hard. That evening, Thomas had to take another one of Duck's trains. Then he had to take his own evening train. Then take Duck's midnight freight train to the mainland. It was morning before Thomas returned to the shed and he was very tired. Toby and Percy were wakened and all and were ready for their day's work. <laughs>